Good morning and welcome to another virtual learning day in our Angora virtual learning community. In today's session, we're going to learn how to insert an audio file in our lesson plan in Verge. Okay, let's give an overview of how it's going to look when we're done. Okay, I have a student and I'm logged in as a student. And as you see, there are images, there's the opening information, and then there's an audio file. In this particular lesson, the teacher wanted to insert uh, directions verbally as well as in writing. So we're going to go into how to actually do that. Okay, let's get started. Step one, I'm going to go and change my view to that of a teacher. I have to do this in the teacher view. Now from the teacher view, I'm going to go to plans and please note my terminology. I'm going to the plans page. I'm going to search for the topic that I'll be inserting my audio file in. So I have my topic and I'll be specifically training page one. That's my topic. And I'll be specifically inserting the audio file in this particular plan. Monday, Unit 1 Overview, Cleaning the Bedroom. Okay, that's the specific plan that I'll be inserting my audio file in. Okay, now from here, I'm going to click on this little symbol right here so that I can edit my description. And when I do that, this dialog box will open. Okay, now let me give you some uh, one disclaimer. In order to record audio, you must first have either a laptop or a computer that can actually record audio, meaning that it has an internal microphone, or you must already have an external microphone already installed or connected to your uh, workstation, um, laptop, or your uh, desktop, okay? So let's get started. I'm going to look at the top of, well, first let's determine where the audio file is gonna be placed in your actual lesson. I have my overall title, an image, and then the subtitle. I want my directions or my audio file to appear between my subtitle and my learning target. Okay, now I want it centered on the actual page. And in order to begin the recording, there's this icon right here that says new audio recording. So I'm going to click that. And this dialog box will open. Let's look at it. I have two different tabs. One up top, or two up top. One says upload, one says record. Record allows me to record directly to the actual uh, platform in Verge. Upload allows me to use a second party application to record my audio. Sometimes teachers want to add music or sound effects or other things. Um, to animate their lessons. Okay, they can use whatever second party, third party operation or platform they want or program they'd like to and then upload the file. Okay, we're not going to do all that. This is the beginner course. We just want to record the audio directly into our actual virtual plan. So now I'm going to click record audio and now I have uh, somewhat of a control box. This allows me to determine what microphone, sometimes you have multiple microphones hooked up. Uh, this lets me, uh, gets, this allows me to predetermine what devices I'll be using. Okay, we're not going to get into any of that, so I'm going to close that. And now I'm ready to record. Record. In three, two, one. Welcome, students. We have an awesome lesson prepared for you today. Today, we have two learning targets. Our first learning target will be to identify each area of the bedroom that will be needed to be maintained daily. Our second learning target is you must explore the origins of and how to get rid of the dreaded bed bugs. Okay, now our success criteria, we have two of them. The success criteria basically uh, says this is how I know as a teacher that you understand these learning targets. This is also how you will know as a student how you um, um, have mastered these targets. Okay, now, st step one, or first success criteria. You must recognize 
a minimum of four different areas of the bedroom that indeed must be maintained on a daily basis. The second criteria is you must successfully devise a remedy to rid, your, rid a home of bed bugs. Okay, so those are two of our success criteria. One, you must determine four different areas of the bedroom that needs to be maintained daily. And two, you must devise a remedy to rid your home of bed bugs. Now, please note, make sure that you, you include factual evidence from the video on how to get rid of bed bugs. Good luck. Have a great day. Now that I've clicked stop, it's rendering, and then it's going to verify, and then it's going to add to my actual plan. Your recording is being uploaded. I can give it a name. Uh, what do I want to call it? I want to call it opening directions, and I'm going to leave it at that. Now, once I hit save, it will actually place it in my actual plan. Now, what I was waiting for is for this to happen. Now, let's say before I save it, I want to listen to it to make sure that it has everything that I want on it. Okay, I could click the play button. Welcome students, we have an yep, awesome it lesson It worked. Prepared for okay, you don't want to hear all that. Okay, so now, all I have to do is click save. And now it is inserted in our actual plan for the day. You won't be able to hear it from here, but it is there. So now I'm going to click save. And now I can see it in my plan. And now what I want to do is go to overview. And when I scroll down, to, you know what? Let's go to the student view. I'm going to the student view. And here's my lesson. Click show more. Here's my audio file. So it worked. So whether I do it here on the plans page or whether I do it here over, or in the over, or view it, whether I view it here in the plans place or view it in the overview page, it is there. Okay. Now let's go through it the same way that a student would. I'm going to click start. And now when I click play, it's going to play my testing audio. One, two, three. Testing one, two, three audio file. Okay, so that concludes today's lesson. We have just learned how to insert an audio file in a lesson on our virtual classroom. Thank you. Have a great day.